so you line up the new connector with the old connector and the way I got it lined up here at the bottom see how there's one slit here one slit at the bottom and then there's two slits up top so they're they're lined up this one's newer that's why it looks different this one's probably factory never been changed but yeah you want to line it up line up the wires as well so we'll be doing some cutting we're gonna have to cut this orange one to about here to make it fit cut that and then for you to strip the wire you want to cut the same length as your cut label on your crimping tool so same length as that and then you want to mark that with your finger and then you want to use I'd say I'd say 12 and then you go around and you you take it off like this it might even be smaller actually or bigger I mean just to shave it off there and then once you've got it shaved off like this You want to turn it, I like to turn it counterclockwise. As much as you can counterclockwise. Keep spinning it, keep spinning it, keep spinning it, keep spinning it. And it should still be the same length as your cut. So I'm going to have to cut a little bit more because it's not the same length make sure you use the bigger I'd say 10 on this one so that you make sure you don't cut any any wires you want actually it's not 10 I think it's 14 actually Are you sure you do, a stop line? Yeah. do the whole length of the cut mark on your crimping tool whole length of the cut How much? I'd say I'd say about it's about sixteen, right? Strip the wire. might need to strip it more I think it's 16 or 14 yeah yeah double check to the sounds to cut mark perfect twist it counterclockwise like I said that's clockwise my bad this is counterclockwise twist it as much as you can like I did to the other one look at the other uh, orange one I did you on real quick look at the uh, orange one I did real quick that's how much you should twist it did you zoom in on it mm -hmm. and did you focus in on it okay mm -hmm. so you want to twist it about that much so after that's ready you want to put in the butt connector so you put it in all the way it's in all the way you get your crimper and you go to your red to your red insulated right because this one's insulated so we're gonna be making a crimp right there about right here okay so making a crimp on the red right here I'd say hold it down for about three seconds to make sure that your crimp's good. One, two, three. And double make sure that it won't come off with you holding them on both sides. 
to make sure you're good. And then what we're going to do is we're going to get a lighter, we're going to shrink it.